Hey boys, welcome back to some more Don Brown and Cricket 17 coverage here. And as as the title suggests, I'm going to be talking about the graphics. So it's it's been annoying me a bit lately. After this world premiere, like with every game, there's going to be people that um uh you know complain about things, give opinions. Like it's not I'm not saying co uh, complaints in general are bad, right? You know, you need people to give criticism for saying to improve. Um, but there's two, there's two main things that people are really focusing on after the world premiere. Um, the first one is the commentary. And first and foremost, I should mention the gameplay. I just got some gameplay from uh, from Twisty3, so link will be in the description. Uh, go check out his channel. He was kind enough to let me use some of his gameplay um, go for his channel to look at some actual, you know, the full videos and him talking about details about the game, stuff like that. But I'm just using this to, like, just show off, just talk about some things and also show off the graphics, I guess. Um, but there's two main things. So the first one is the commentary. You know, people are really ripping into the commentary. And I'll be 100% honest, I agree with people about the commentary. I think it is pretty bad from what I've heard. And But I'm not going to pass judgment on it just yet, due to the fact that we only we've only seen a few videos uh, from this world premiere. We don't know. Obviously, this isn't the very final build. Um, this and that, but I feel like the commentary is going to be pretty similar to that in the release. And you know, it, I'll, like I said, I don't think it's it's very good. I think it's pretty. It just doesn't flow well. I don't think the people doing it are too bad, but it just it doesn't flow well at all. But honestly, for me, it's not a big issue. I would turn commentary off in most sports games anyway. So, yeah, I'm not I'm not bothered by the uh, the commentary. I know some people might might be, but I'll agree with people on that point. The other point that I can't agree with is people people are just on the fact that they reckon this game looks worse than Cricket 14. They, they people are just going on about how was the game downgraded from from the last game <laughs> as we see a nice little relay throw, but uh. <laughs> But there's, there's a few things to mention about the graphics. So, first and foremost, the game looks a lot better. Okay, so the the animations in general look smoother. Playing just the demo in, like, the nets and then on the on the ground for PC, just the demo, the animations look f smoother, they feel smoother, all that sort of good stuff. Uh, just general, like, the, the lighting looks a lot better, uh, all that. I mean, go back and watch, like, some Don Brown and Cricket 14 videos and... You'll see a difference in just the lighting and uh, the animations, like uh, celebrations and all this other stuff. It, it's it's a lot better, okay. But there's a few things that are that make it look worse. So so a big one is the fact that all the players are generic, made up players. They're not they're not realistic players. Uh, you can go on the academy and some of the detailed players look incredible. But in this, in the world premiere, there's, they're obviously just generic players. None of them are, they're not real players, so they they look, they don't look right in the game, and they they don't look that fluid, and it, it looks it, you know, the player models and play detail characters all that stuff, it makes the game look worse. But if you if you replace all these characters here with actual real life players, it would be a nine day difference. It would be an absolute nine day difference. That's one thing you have to keep in mind. Another thing is that the videos that were uploaded, um, they were only 720p. I actually, I actually don't know if the game, like what um, exactly like the game runs at and stuff, but obviously it was captured on a capture device. Uh, actually playing the game, it's going to look prettier. That's just the way games work. YouTube, uh, you know, when you upload to YouTube, it, it degrades the quality. Um, and using different capture cards also degrades the quality, but just in general, like, regards, it doesn't even matter about that, it just, it still looks a lot better. The other thing to keep in mind is, like, the game might look a little, it, like, it doesn't look that, sm watching the gameplay videos, I, I've been a bit like, well, the, you know, it doesn't look as smooth and stuff, but you got another thing you gotta remember is, these are two real humans playing against each other. It's not AI. It's not like these these guys playing the game. 
you know, they, they're not doing everything correctly. They're, like, the gameplay is pretty bad. The gameplay is, is pretty bad in a lot of these situations because, you know, they, they're at an event. You know, people are watching them. They're just having a good time. They're just trying to feel the game out and stuff like that. I mean, they're not, like, they're not at home just, uh, you know, playing playing well, playing against the AI, doing things right. So it's going to make the game look a little... Not not necessarily worse, but just uh, the overall game. It gives it a, a different perspective. Like, it's two two people that have never played Don Brown and Cricket for, uh, 17 before. So that's... You know, you got to keep that in mind as well. So overall, like, the... The, the menu system, the the animations, the overall, I think the lighting, I think the actual, like, the stadiums and the crowd, the crowd actually looks uh, pretty good as well. Like, I've seen a few, like, up-close shots of, like, crowd, you know, cheering and stuff like that, and uh, it looks it, it looks pretty, pretty good. Um, going back to, like, Rugby League Live 3, the last game Big Ant made, it, it's probably on par with that, maybe a little better, I think it might be a little better, the crowd detail and stuff like that, and, uh, just, like, the stadium designs and all that is, like, a fair bit better. Another thing to keep in mind as well is also, just, like, there's a lot, like, I'm happy with the way this game handles, like, there's sort of, like, little cutscenes where, you know, your batter walks out and gets out, and, like, those, uh, cutscenes like that, it's not, like, over the top, like, a like a Madden or something like that, which I don't actually like. But in this game, it I think it does it pretty well. It's a fairly realistic looking thing, and it looks a lot better than uh, Don Brown and Cricket 14. So I just felt like making this video because because I was get, I was getting a little frustrated with people just bagging on their graphics. Like <laughs> just wait, you know, just wait until the game is released. You've imported all the characters. Um, it's 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 a much better looking game. Like there there's no question about it. It's a it's a much better looking game. There are some, you know, there are some some things that um, could be improved in terms of uh, the looks of it. But like honestly, people saying it's a downgrade, it's definitely not a downgrade. A hundred percent, everything about it is definitely an upgrade. There's just no way there's gonna be a downgrade from uh from the last game. Um, and think like the other another thing to keep in mind is tweaks like lighting and also colors. Like colors are a huge part. I remember a game that just came out, Dragon Ball Xenoverse Two, right? When that game came out, like I saw a video on this. The game released and it looked pretty bad. It was like really washed out. All yet, all people did was like increase the brightness to max, and it looked. It actually looked incredible. I'm not saying. This game is like in in that sense is all oh, you just have to turn the brightness up or something like that, but it, it showcases that just a little tweaking to like lighting or or contrast or color can really change up the way a game looks. So I'm sure there's going to be tweaking done, uh, little tweaks done to stuff like that to polish the game up. But overall, the game it looks very good. It looks a lot better than the last game. So that that's this video done and dusted. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. You know, I'm I'm extremely excited for the release. I can't wait to uh to play the game. Hopefully you guys are in the same boat and uh stay tuned for more more Don Brown and Cricket 17 and uh definitely career modes when it releases. But yeah, other than that, hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time.